Welcome to the first of a series of companion videos for my new text, Dance Production Design and Technology through Focal Press. I wanted these videos to be a conversational approach to some of the tools and tricks I've picked up along the way, and hopefully they're going to serve as an opportunity for some of you at home to share your own ideas as well. You can find out more about this at the end of the video. This video will discuss a little bit about the process of selecting a color medium, sometimes called a gel. A gel is a plastic color medium that reduces certain wavelengths of light, leaving behind only the desired color. When discussing a gel, there are two important terms to keep in mind, saturation and transmission. In lighting terms, saturation refers to the measure of the amount of color present in a light. For instance, looking at this image, you can see that there is an incredibly saturated blue washing the stage. While vivid in color, you'll notice that there's not a lot of white light to give detail to the image. When looking at the color wheel, you can see exactly why this works. What we refer to as white light is actually the combination of all of the colors in the visible color spectrum. In order to create a truly saturated color, we must remove all of the other wavelengths that are not that particular color. This explains why truly saturated colors in lighting do not have a lot of white light present. Transmission is a term that we use to discuss the amount of light that can pass through a gel. The greater the amount of wavelengths that can pass through a gel, the closer the resulting color of light will be to white. Most gel manufacturers include some type of a chart that indicate the transmission of the gel. In this example, Roscoe number 342, also called rose pink, has a transmission factor of 16%. This indicates that only 16% of the visible spectrum would be transmitted through the gel. In other words, this gel would produce an incredibly saturated color. In addition to basic transmission, there's also an interesting chart that is included with each swatch. This graph illustrates the visible spectrum of light and how much of each color is transmitted through the gel. The divisions from left to right break down the visible colors in the spectrum from violet to red. The peaks and valleys of the graph indicate just exactly how much of each individual hue is present in the resulting beam of light. Understanding these terms and concepts can go a long way towards helping you select the right color medium for your production. 